Stock markets are subjected to market risk. Please read scheme related documents carefully. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel and I have been working day and night to bring this analysis towards you. Today we are going to talk about Avenue Supermarts and the target the current price is 3378 and the current uh, target price that I have set is 3686 and also towards the quick pointers a strong second would have resulted in loss of more days and still there is no significant impact on the store operations and they are rising in footballs the rising in football means uh, more customers are appearing towards the stores they are entering the stores that is called rising footballs and when we go to the quick pointers there is also online scalability has been positive so now the quarter one fy strong a strong second wave in there was also a loss because of the restrictions on the number of store operation hours and also there is no significant impact on supply during the quarter in and the inventory has been moving towards a normal level now if we consider a demart quarter one results despite the impact of strong second covid 19 wave and with business loss of more days of non-essential sales and rising footballs the vaccination drive has been uh, 203 percent all across india and why it is good it is good because uh, there are near term challenges and this near term challenges have been appearing optimistic and increase in the uh, sales and scope of dmat ready app this dmat ready app is the app uh, for them to conduct e-commerce operations and extending offers on dmat like fresh food and fresh vegetables to be included in this merchandise and the growth of this merchandise and sales over uh, to grow on a lower basis and there will be a steady store expansion and the sales growth and demand ready app works on new store openings in new new regions and the bill value is expected to rise because of inflation and high drive picking of the lockdown uh, we expect a demat to be conducting in the coming quarters and we estimate a 42.3 percent profit after tax uh, on the estimate as per the calculation now the sales have been 31 percent and uh, the EBITDA has been increased to 103 uh, percent and profit after tax is 132.3 percent so now the covid impact it has been despite of the less operating hours and the restriction the, the customer footfalls were seen this year increasing to high sales and what the company is trying to say and the company is uh, trying to make us convinced that if 45 days are given of unhindrance wherein a normal situation is given then they will bring back to that pre-covid levels of sales and uh, when the inventory is concerned and the inventory is also moving towards uh, normal levels uh, and this time the company has opened four new stores and all over its sites and expected to accelerate in the coming quarters now rise in e-commerce focus is very positive and a demat increases to 203 percent year on year basis even the covid situation has led to expanded changes in for online and there is a requirement and this situation had made this ready business and the name of that app is dmat ready so the online business conducting will 
gradually expand in the places like Aham uh, Ahmedabad then Pune Bangalore and Hyderabad so the ready stores will be beneficial so I would like to talk about how they have increased their uh, store openings in those particular regions uh, and there are 214 stores all over these places these places I have marked over here so and now in 2021 there are 234 stores all across the same regions they have uh, they have not expanded to North India or Northeast in uh, India so they have continued to increase the store uh, stores in those previous regions uh, so this is all I would like to say uh, uh, thanks for watching my video and have a great day ahead and follow all the protocols given by the government thank you